Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for always stopping by, liking, commenting, and subscribing. For the new ones, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, turn on notification bell so that you'll be notified on when I drop updates on Unfortunate Love. Stay tuned on today's episode. Malishka makes him promise he will always listen to her. Ayush informs him Lakshmi reached home and she's with her sisters now that Shalu is very mad at him. When she goes to his room to stay alone for some time, Ayush feels sorry he couldn't help Lakshmi with the truth. Rano gives the shocking news to Neha, who is happy that Lakshmi's marriage broke. Mama Ji overhears them and rushes to meet Lakshmi and tells Rishi has done wrong with Lakshmi. He will take an answer from Rishi for the deceit and meet Lakshmi, consoles her and tells she needs not to worry. He's still alive to help her. Rano tells them she isn't dead. She runs the house and manages the expenses with difficulties and doesn't want more burden on herself, argues with her husband and asks Lakshmi to go back to her sasural. Lakshmi doesn't want to go back she tells Rishi's affairs doesn't matter it happens but a marriage doesn't break and threatens to throw out Shalu and Banu also Mamaji begs Rano to not do such a thing Rano spares Lakshmi on his request and tells she will not throw Lakshmi out at night but she will take her to Rishi's house in the morning Lakshmi and Rishi miss each other and thinks of each other Shalu does the eight to Lakshmi's injured foot Lakshmi is heartbroken and thinks of Rishi's words Shalu cries in Lakshmi Rishi misses Lakshmi. Banya and Shalu share their pain. Lakshmi gets Rishi's call but doesn't pick it and remembers her promise to her dad, goes to console her sisters and tells she can tolerate anything but not deceit, which ends relation completely. That she has no relation with Rishi now, pretends to be strong and asks them not to get sorrowful. They shall get positive. The truth came out. She doesn't want to cry for Rishi anymore and hugs her sisters. Rano wakes up, tells Neha she has to take Lakshmi to the Obiroy mansion. Neha asks her not to delay and catch Lakshmi. Rishi wakes up, misses Lakshmi, thinks of her. Their moment cries for her. Rano asks Lakshmi to go back to Obiroy house. Lakshmi refuses and tells she will do a job, give money to her and Rano and asks Rano not to oust her sister from the house. Ayush meets Rishi and asks him if he called Lashmi to know how she is. Rishi tells him he was so heartbroken when he saw Lashmi in danger and tells Ayush he was searching for her madly when he reached her at the temple. She yelled at him a lot. It was justified. He didn't say a word to her. He scolded Malishka instead. Tells Nilam slapped him and Viranda also punished him. Even Ayush is fighting with him and asks if he's such a bad person. He wants his family to think about him as well. Lashmi tries to strike a deal with Rano, tells Neha she would give the rent and also separate money for the food. Neha and Rano agree to accept the money. Lashmi tells she will arrange money and give it to her that she has gotten over her sorrow and picked up the courage. A new morning has come for her because of her supportive sisters. Mama Jova hears them. Rano gives two days to Lashmi to find a good job. Lakshmi tells she can't waste more time on the argument. Rishi wants Lakshmi and family to know his point of view and asks Ayush if he forced the family to get him married to Lakshmi. He feels everyone is treating him like a devil and asks Ayush to give him opinions to tell him where he went wrong. He wants to tell the truth to Lakshmi. Ayush tells Rishi didn't lose anything, neither his house. He wasn't cheated like Lakshmi got cheated. He tells his marriage with Malishka was his decision. He could have waited for a year and caused Rishi wrong. Rishi tells his the culprit he will ask the entire family to beat him, wants to tell the family about his emotions. Shalu gives the best wishes to Lakshmi when she, she's leaving for the interview. Lakshmi misses her dad. Ayush asks Rishi to understand Lakshmi's feelings. Rishi tells he didn't know Lakshmi would see him marry Malishka. Regrets Lakshmi got cheated, calls her wrong for not listening to his side of story once. Dean won't answer his calls. Ayush asks how Lakshmi is. Rishi tells she's doing bad with him when he's trying to do good he's getting affected and feeling bad she isn't talking to him he doesn't care for her now gets upset mama g blesses lashmi to go and bag a good job sends her off rishi is still missing lashmi but not realizing his mistakes gets angered and dumps her things imagines her with him recalls her words and gets disturbed lashmi gets goes to hire auto rickshaw sees rishi in his car realizes she's just imagining him everywhere Thinks she has to control her mind, shed tears in his memory. Malishka meets Kiran and tells she's really happy her stressful days are finally over. She's going to marry Rishi. Calls him and asks if he's okay. He tells he's okay and apologizes for his rude behavior. She tells she understands him well. She has planned a surprise for him and asks him not to refuse to her. The last me ended her chapter herself. They shall meet in fresh start. Rishi agrees with her. Malishka tells Kiran she wants a stress-free day. Feels it's good the truth came out 
Everyone was getting tortured because of the lies. She's happy for Lashmi, who can start a new life. Lashmi reaches some office for the job interview, tells she's a fresher, she has no job experience, leaves and visits another. The man tells he has seen her on TV with Rishi. She's Rishi's wife. She can get a job if she can recommend his company to Rishi. She refuses to help him and loses hope, leaves from the office, comes across Rishi on the road. They have a hit and a miss. Rishi feels Lakshmi's presence, runs back to see Lakshmi, but she leaves by then. Lakshmi doesn't give up. Call, call other companies to fix interviews, find an old man getting an attack at runs to help. Karishma tells Sonia that Nilam has gone to Lakshmi's house to get her back for Rishi's sake, tells how Pandit warned Nilam about the threat on Rishi and asks her to get Lakshmi back that Rishi is under threats until seven days. He should be away from Iron. She tells Nilam worriedly called Rishi home but he didn't come till now. Nilam tells Rano she has come to take Lakshmi home, checks the house. Rano tells Lakshmi is in home. Charlotte gets triggered seeing her. Lashmi takes the old man to the hospital for his treatment and asks his friends why they are joking when the person is really ill. That friendship is important than money. Gets an urgent call, finds the boy in pain, runs to help him. Dumpto thanks her for help and tells the boy has a leg fracture. He just fell down the bed and got hurt again. Lashmi tells the story to the boy to lessen his pain. Dashan looks at Lashmi who ignores the important calls to be with the boy and realizes she is leaving her interviews to help people. Nilam vents anger on Rano, Shalu and Bani. Rano tells Lashmi didn't do right to leave her sasural. Nilam tells she's believed Lashmi's value but she has proved her wrong. She asks if anyone leaves the house because of a small misunderstanding. Shalu tells they make relations with her and not the bank balance and asks Nilam not to talk back at bad about Lakshmi, but think of Rishi who had an extramarital affair. Nilam warns her to stay in her limit. Shalu tells Rishi did wrong with values, with his values and should be questioned. She answers Nilam well. Thank you guys for watching today's update on Unfortunate Love. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and stay tuned for more updates. Bye.